for the cup, at least that's what we uh, were doing, right? The Tampa Bay Lightning, they fell just two wins short from winning that third cup title. Colorado skated away with that two to one win last night in game six. But the Lightning are already looking forward to next year. And sports anchor Kyle Berger is here with why the team's winning ways are far from over. Just as the Colorado Avalanche skated the Stanley Cup on Tampa Bay's home ice, anger and disappointment set in the Lightning locker room. We know that feeling that they're having over there right now. It's the best in the world. And, you know, sometimes you forget the other side of it. The other side of it, losing in the last game of the season, is a feeling the Lightning have not experienced in over three years. You remember the teams you win with. Regardless of the league you're coaching in, you'll always remember those teams. And you don't remember as much the ones you don't win with. But I will always remember this team for what they endured, what they went through. To get to this point, it's, you have to marvel at them. It's a little shock and awe. It was a closely matched series. Four of the six games were decided by one goal, and Colorado needed overtime for two of its wins. When the final horn sounded, Tampa Bay had played a lot of hockey, 71 playoff games over the last three seasons. It was just a grind. I mean, it, it was, that's what makes it even tougher because you realize how hard you work to get here, and disappointment is, you probably can't put it into words. The core of this team is still intact and with younger players with upside on the roster, Stamco says the Lightning story isn't over. Who says we're done, right? I mean, this, this core is here and we've battled, we've been through everything you can think of and for the most part we found a way to come out on top. And I'm sure there's a lot of people that were doubting that we'd even get back to this point and it's going to be the same thing next year, but for the group that will be back and the coaching staff, we're going to leave it all out there again and, and go as far as we can. In Tampa, Kyle Berger, ABC Action News.